So, over like the last period, like ever since Julius came out, the speed metal in Arena has been insane and I really don't like speed metal whatsoever. I'm so tired of Finro and Valtos teams. Like, it is just annoying and I don't think it's fun where you, you just get one tap. You can't do any strategy or anything. I don't really like that. Like, yeah, maybe it's fun to like, like when you're the one doing it. But like, when you lose just because they were faster and they just one tap you, I don't think that's fun. I prefer to lose if like, you know, I misplay or like... The, what their defense had like a really good setup or team comp that really just messed me up. I don't really like just brain dead um baby tap team. So I kind of found a way to counter the speed meta. And as you can see here, I've been winning attacks ever since that, and even winning defenses since I done this one switch. And before then, I was losing pretty bad. You see here, I was losing, but now I got the set the team and the setup to do this and. I really didn't didn't even want to do this to be honest because I don't like running like you know what's the meta and stuff but I guess this is kind of meta or whatever <laughs> so I'm basically running a blue oh shoot I'm basically running a full blue team with Lotus, Marsh, Charmy, and Julius but the way I done this is I build Lotus to be a tank I've got so Lotus has 9k Nine. Yeah, 9k defense, almost 10,000. I can probably bump it up, honestly. And I gave him full defense. Like, he has the full set here, so he's getting the 40% increase. And he's getting 8% forgery, and then he gets bonus defense here. I put, I gave him a bit of magic attack just so he does some damage, but mostly I put in, like, the defense stuff, you know, and the HP, and they're all level up. And I got this LR piece. Um, when I crafted it and this is some 30 plus defense and I gave him also this skill page silent stone silent stones a really good skill page for this build because it gets plus 50% defense and plus 10 endurance so I have found that with this Lotus can tank a Julius alt completely Charmy is built um, still with um, HP in mind, you know, I, and, but I gave her Forgery, this, you can craft it, and the HP gear, and then this in case she gets stunned so her speed gets buffed. Because I'm not trying to outspeed them, the only one who has speed, really speed gear right in this team is Julius. Julius is the only one that has speed gear right now. Mars, you know, he's running mostly attack, but he has the defense stuff. But I got him like a lot of attack, so he's doing damage. He can already tank pretty well. And I also changed his skill page out oh, for second skill page Simple because using Mars skill page for this, it's not the greatest because he needs the. What I found is this: if I use Mars's skill page, he has put the potential to get nuked. If I use second skill page, which his skill page at max, which you should have second skill page max, if, unless you're a new player. It gives 30 plus defense and 5% HP. Mars with his skill page, yeah, he gets the increase two turns off his skill one. But when it comes to fighting a speed team, Mars might not even do his skill one in time to get that increased defense buff. And it's only one. And yeah, he gets for forgery whenever he gets hit for like, you know, and it stacks up to four turns. But I'd rather take a guaranteed 30% buff because if Julius ults Mars and then Noel comes with that speed, my Mars might die. Even with the 16k defense, th this is like, yeah, I it's just what I've done, okay? I know I'm stuttering a lot. <laughs> I'm not used to just recording and stuff. So, let m so this is honestly, this is a team. It's probably not speed meta or whatever, but... Actually, let me do a free refresh. Okay, I'm gonna go. Okay, this is definitely a speed meta team. Oh lord, I might lose this. Okay, so the way I lose, if the Julius ults my Julius, then I lose. But if they Julius does not ult my Julius, I win. That's the way I figure this stuff goes. But now that I say that and I'm recording, I am gonna get ulted by the Julius and I'm gonna cry. All right, take two. This is the speed team. Oh my god! Of course, my luck, bro. Had he had to ult my Julius.
I had a feeling that was gonna happen because I was recording, bro. Okay, so here we go. This is another speed team. This is the most common one you'll see. Julius Noel Valtos. Most common one. Let's just do this, okay? I'm already in a sour mood after that. The thing is, if my like, Julius gets ulted, like, yeah, the team can fall apart pretty badly. Because Julius is the main damage dealer. Lotus is also the damage dealer. Um, the issue why it's kind of bad if they ult the Julius... If the other Julius ults the Julius, it's because then he gets the extra turn, and then he does the time stop, and then I don't get a turn, and then I don't get to heal, which kind of messes me up. So, yeah, but Lotus sometimes can carry, but I don't have him build, like, you know, magic attack, so sometimes it doesn't work out. So, yeah, here we go. This is usually how it it's usually goes out, like I said, unless I got really unlucky in the ult my Julius. And with the defense team, they tend to ult the Julius. Like I said, sometimes Lotus can just carry by himself because he does pretty good damage. And sometimes the RNG- oh shoot, I didn't mean that. The RNG with Lotus is, um, I'll show the preset. Lotus's skill 1, as you know, has a chance to reduce mobility, and that's the key to winning in defensive if they ult the Julius, which most likely they're gonna. How many times have I said ult the Julius? <laughs> okay, but as you can see here, I tanked it really well, and there's not much you can do. I'm just killing you slowly because I hate you. So screw yourself. You die by Charmy! <laughs> okay, so that's how I'm countering speed meta right now. The other way you can counter speed meta... Hold up, let me show it here. Oh my god, I, I hate this AI, bro. <laughs> I really hate So, this is the presets I'm using. I'm using the preset where Julius ults first and then does time magic. The reason why Julius is ulting, because stun is really good, and if he kills, extra turn. Now, I also have Charmy. I thought I wasn't recording for a second. I also have Charmy using his ultimate... Is? Her ultimate! First, because increased defense, then skill 2. Mars does the combo attack... If he can't do the combo attack, then he will do his skill 2 to try to get the stun. Lotus skill 1. Now, what I originally had, I removed the skill 2 and just had Lotus do his skill 1. But what I noticed is this. I need to have Lotus do his skill 2 because that's a single target ability. And Noel, if they have an enemy Noel team, remember, you, you are the AI nice. when they attack you. So what they like to do is they like to put up the barrier if they see a Lotus. And then Noel is just gonna start slowly willing down your health and doing more damage while the Julius also ranks up the da damage on their team. So that's why Lotus has a skill 2 on, otherwise I would have kept that removed. The other thing you can do if you, for some reason, are missing one of these units, um, you can replace someone with Nozel. Come with me and be And a make Nozel do his skill, his ultimate, and then his skill 2, because his skill 2 reduces damage it reduces magic attack which is am really Captain good in this current meta with everything's doing magic attack noel does magic attack julius does magic attack you're not seeing red Osta often and he also lowers the damage with this ultimate by 34 percent now the thing about when you're building nozel um you're gonna have to build them tanky as well but give him a little speed so he outpaces lotus because nozel is gonna need to cast that debuff immediately but if you have julius this is the team you should be running you can also replace charmy with season one mimosa if you use season one mimosa you're gonna want to use ultimate skill two just keep to that and you're also gonna want to build your a you know magic attack uh, similar to like lotus you know pretty much just the lotus build i have is what you're gonna want to put on mimosa as well you know. right here so that's how you can counter the speed meta um there's not really other units I say you can go for. This is really the only way you can pretty much counter it. You're gonna need Mars and you're gonna need Lotus because Lotus is the key to winning in the in this defense team. Well, if you're doing attack, just do whatever you want, you know, at the end of the day. But you need Lotus to win this attack defense. I'm stuttering, bro. I'm sorry. I'm used to editing my stutterings. Okay, so I hope that helps you, and I wish you all luck in your arena. Like I said, my defense is low because I was losing badly for a while because I didn't- I was like- I was using fin roll. But now that I'm doing this, my percentage went up good, and again, my attack went down because I was trying to test things out. 
So, yeah, hopefully this helps you out, and I wish you luck as I go tackle this another speed meta. See you later. Alto out. A new video out, hopefully tomorrow or later, depending when I get to editing. Bye, y'all!